Hey, you guys. All right, let's see where our energy is. I'm going to pull from the... Hmm, I was going to say the message is love. Anyway, let me say my spiel. Please like, share, subscribe, hit the bell notification to be notified when I come on. I have 30 minutes until... I get myself together. Oh, here it is. I'll go ahead and pull from the messages of love to see where we are. You guys, please like, share, subscribe. Sorry, I'm back to normal. Hit the bell notification to be notified when I come on. Thank you for all of your support. Thank you for all of the comments. Thank you for just being there. You know, that just makes me so happy. So there you have it. Let's see. Sorry. I've been on uh, TikTok. There you have it. I'm going to do a TikTok one day. Just give me a minute. All right, let's see what the energy is. See what we're working with. Balance. Balance came out. Balance and regret and children. Oh, wow. Balance, regret, regret and children and time apart. It says balance. One person is given too much in this relationship, so there has to be some type of balance. There is regret. Someone feels remorse for the way that they treated you, you know, because you gave your all in this relationship. Sorry. I'm trying to see if what I can see here. And then the other. Hold on one second, you guys. All right. Okay, you can see. Sorry about that. And the other one is children. Children are important to this partnership. So I don't know. You tell me. Take what resonates, leave what doesn't. Bottom of the deck is time apart. Some distance will help bring clarity. I don't know why this, uh, why children play a part in this relationship. Maybe someone stepped out on you. Um, I'm going to, whoa. I think I just will pull regular tarot. I don't think I need to pull. No, I'll pull my Monopoly tarot. So balanced. Sorry, you guys. I'm all over the place today. But just work with me and my energy right now. I had to sit back for a minute and just get get it back together. So anyway, balance. Some someone one person is given too much in this relationship. Collaboration. There's no collaboration. And that's the reason why, you know, the universe is letting you know three of Pentacles energy. Pentacles, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. The next one is messenger of romance and invitation. Someone can always bring you an invitation when it comes to them getting the romance and the things that they want but for some reason knight of cups energy always follow your heart it'll never lead you astray because it knows things your mind can't explain but for some reason this collaboration is is making me when when they say that someone one person is given too much in this relationship it just seems to me with the collaboration three of pentacles card coming out and then the knight of cups is coming out you're there you are given too much in this relationship and they're given so much in other relationships so they could be collaborating could be third party energy or it could be them collaborating with one other person but you have the queen of wands energy confidence shines from the inside when you love yourself own your flaws and rock them without caring what others think um so you have pretty much all the elements on the board except um air energy you see that one it says Someone feels remorse for the way they treated you, starting stable. And so now they want to start over. I don't know, take what resonates, leave what doesn't. It just seems like now they're ready to start over because they see that, uh, you know, they that you're moving and pulling back from this energy. So they want to start over. So they regret the way they treated you. And so that's the reason why they're saying to you, this same messenger of romance and invitation is saying, let's start over. You know, let's start over ambition, uh, ambition, supporter of ambition and success. I realized that I didn't support you like I should have. And now I want to just start over with you. But you know what? Depending on where they caught you at in this situation, you're just like, you know what? Either it is that they had a child or that you have children and you're not worried about them anymore. You're putting you and your children up first and not saying that you didn't put your children first. I'm saying that you put them and your children before you put yourself. Does that make sense? So children are an important part of this relationship or to this relationship. Yeah, because you're a nurturer or maybe they were the childlike person that you were nurturing. If the children wasn't involved in your relationship, then, you know, the Empress energy caring for others. You know, Empress says... Um, 
Nurture your creative gifts and talents. Share your gifts with the world and create all that you desire in life. You're sharing them with the world because either you nurtured this energy too much to where you guys need time apart and you're just over it. And so that's why it says time apart. Some distance will help bring clarity. Yeah, the distance is causing them to realize that they regret the way they treated you and that you were given all in the relationship. So they now want to collaborate with you. They want to come with you and tell you, let's start over. And I'm going to support you because they realize that you nurtured everything, including their children or including you, them and your children. And you didn't nurture um you didn't nurture yourself. And so now independence. Yeah, you're independent now. Bottom of the deck, nine of pentacles energy. You know, you're being independent. Let me go ahead and pull from the mixed emotions deck to see where your emotion is. Your emotions are when it comes to this energy. You know, this person has made you feel some type of way. And at that same point, you're just like, no, there needs to be some type of balance. You know, they regret how they treated you. But in the process of you going through this, it made you stronger. But why should you have to go through this in order to get teamwork? You know, these cards came out. Grief. Yeah, heartbroken. You know, you're heartbroken because you've given your all to everybody. And in turn, you feel disgusted because this person can't even give to you. The person who you're looking forward to, yeah, inadequate. It made you feel worthless or incom uh, incompetent, you know. And so that, that you couldn't, you know, the way that they gave you their energy made you feel like you weren't worthy of it. And in turn, it drained you and made you feel exhausted. Does that make sense? You know, we have angry so once you've got angry, you know what the universe said, you know what, don't get angry, you know, don't get angry. Let's figure out a different way in order to come across this energy. So now I'm going to go ahead and pull from my favorite deck. Where is it at? Right here. This is the Gregory Scott deck in regards to the Queen of Wands because or this balanced energy, you know, collaboration messages of romance you know i'm gonna go ahead and pull energy because yeah you have justice justice consequences of their action is on on your side you know the consequences of their action um are at hand and so now you removing your energy is letting them know that you know what you're starting over you don't need them you know and now they're starting to say well what did i do wrong you know why is this person feeling this way yeah six of swords because you left i'm telling you because you left them. You left them. Six of Swords energy is new beginnings, change, and new love. You left them. And now here it is with the children card and the empress being here. You know, you're nurturing yourself. You're nurturing everything else but them. You know, you're putting yourself first. You're, you know, before you were just putting them and your children, you know, that person or your children and then that person first. And now here it is. You're putting yourself first. You're not worried about anything else because this energy, yeah, Six of Pentacles, give to others wholeheartedly before you expect to receive the same yourself. However, you gave to this energy, but you're nurturing and you're giving your blessings to the people who deserve them. You know, does that make sense? And then we have the high priestess. You use your intuition. This is uh, something that can only be understood through experience. So this angry um, this angry energy, the time apart will help you understand that you have to be independent and you can't rely on anyone to make you feel loved, you know, and if they're not giving you the same energy that you give them, then it's time for you to remove yourself. So I'm going to pull one card from this deck. Uh, well, actually, you know, what? I don't want this one. I want the in the shadows deck. I'm going to pull a card from the in the shadows deck because we're going to see what they have to say with them being in the shadows and not in your life. Does that make sense? Um, yeah, because they are realizing that. The regret comes when they see that you've removed yourself, you know? Look at this uh, lady. She has, you know, she has a gift. And the gift that's there is the gift that she's given to herself. You know, she's blessing herself because, you know what? The consequences of that person's actions, are, I fear that you will reject me. Of course you will. Of course you will reject them. Bottom of the deck. I took the easy way out. Yes, they did. And so you being angry at first and enraged or furious about the way that they treated you is normal. But you use your intuition and you said, you know what? I'm going to focus on me. I'm going to focus on me. Yeah, your body language says so much. Yeah, they took the easy way out. And yes, your body language is not the same when it comes to them. You're no longer nurturing this situation. You're moving forward with this energy and going from here. Let me pull from the tea leaf oracle deck i'll just pull two cards 
two tea leaf cards, and then I'll pull a month, and then I'll pull an astral uh, house card. So the month of the year is here, and then I'll pull the astral house happiness. This keeps coming out, and I keep, even if I shuffle it, there is cards right here. I could have pulled these three, but these keep coming out. The happiness card, frying pan, trouble and accusation. So, you know, you're not accusing this person. This person is probably accusing you ear. There's good news because you're working on yourself. And then the month is May. May is the month that everything will come and take place. And you will won't you won't regret you working on yourself and walking away and um not worrying about any energies out there. And so then we have the empath oracle, which is I created. This is 24 different emotions on how I feel when, you know, I feel exhausted or when I feel like, you know, the universe is, you know, has a message for me, uh, feeling overwhelmed or something. Love, you know, love yourself. This is love yourself because you've tried to love everyone else. And this is completion. Yeah, you've reached a point in your life where you're done with the energies that no longer serve you. So there you have it, you guys. Uh, please like, share, subscribe. This was the message of the day. Have a nice day, you guys. Bye-bye.